Now at 5.30, a big push for vaccinations against COVID, flu, and RSV is being met with some resistance by those recommended to take that vaccine. This is a new COVID strain begins its move to becoming the dominant variant. Eyewitness News reporter Will Silverstein spoke with shoppers in Northwest Bakersfield and some medical professionals. Will, what did you learn? Well, Michael, from those medical professionals, I learned people can receive all three vaccines at once. But from those shoppers, well, I learned there may not be vaccine hesitancy as much as a lack of urgency to get vaccinated. Nothing that I worry about. It's just like I just don't, I just rather not to get it. This shopper has no plans for a vaccine this fall. So I did have it like years ago, but yeah, I just decided not to get it this year. Our second shopper, well, he's not getting a vaccine either and is not worried about getting sick. You're no, I'm not worried about it. So you're not too worried about getting too sick? And no. My body recovers, it recovers. If it doesn't, it doesn't. I'm, it doesn't. Just, I'm that kind of person. Yeah. Definitely seeing all three viruses predominant this winter. Dr. Pooja Vitalani with Kaiser Permanente is recommending people get vaccinated with all three vaccines, COVID, flu, and RSV. The doctor says all three are respiratory viruses that spread easily coughing, sneezing, even hand holding, sharing drinks, all of these things can pass these viruses from one person to another. Despite their easy spread and easy solution to get vaccinated, many Americans have no plans on getting the vaccines. Only one in five adults have received the updated COVID vaccine with more than 30% of adults between the ages of 18 to 64. They say they will not get the COVID vaccine. A recent Ohio State University study added flu to the question and still around a third of respondents say they will not receive the vaccine either. Vitalani is used to working with those who have concerns about vaccines. We ask them if they have any questions about it and one by one we address each question and concern so that they feel secure in making that decision whether they want to take it or not. This week is uh, recognized as National Influenza Vaccination Week. Safe Namik with CVS says this week helps promote safety against flu while most doctors and pharmacists recommend receiving the vaccine in the early fall. Namik says there is no time like the present to protect yourself against the seasonal illness. For the vaccine to work, it takes up to two weeks uh, to get that full effect of the vaccine. So getting it in December, uh, especially in early December, is uh, very important for patients to get full protection from the, from the flu. Now, Namik says scheduling a, a, an appointment with CVS is very easy. Mentioning you can do so from a phone call or their app. Walk-ins are also welcome. Just wait those extra 15 minutes after receiving your COVID vaccine. Reporting in studio, Will Silverstein, Eyewitness News.